Hi everyone, we're back with the Eureka Flash Powerful Lightweight Corded Stick Vacuum. It has no loss of suction, it easily converts into a hand vac, deep cleans, carpets, and hard floors, and has whole home cleaning. You see it deep cleans carpets and whole floors, it has swivel steering, reaches under furniture, and has above floor cleaning as well. Whoa, come on. Finger, fingertip controls, portable storage base, which is cool, stickers covering it up. It includes the vacuum, three, uh, two in one dusting brush, and crevice tool. So let's open the Eureka Flash up and see what's inside. Looks like it's going to be coming out like this. It's really tricky to do with one hand, but I'll manage. Got it. So here is your storage base. The vacuum it sits on, and you can store tools on it too. Pretty cool. Here's the tube. Pretty cool. This metal, decent on the large on the inside. Let's do the power head next. So here's your power head. Pretty stiff bristles. Decent edge cleaning on this side. Not the best on this side, but should be fine. I do see the ability to clean the brush roll. I'm not sure if it comes out though. It does have headlights as you can see here. It's pretty good. Rubberized wheels, felt so shouldn't scratch your hard wood. There's a tool or, now that's part of the stand. Let's see, we have a crevice tool right here. Whoops. Right now, this is the brush, the dusting brush. Well, it is the crevice tool. Not the best crevice tool I've seen. And a dusting brush, and there's a... Oh, so here's the actual crevice tool. This is supposed to be like a really basic, tiny upholstery tool. I would probably just use the power head. All right, here's the hand vac itself. The best for last. Let's see, we have the cyclone right here. Pretty interesting design. So it definitely reminds me of the shark rocket. You can see the filters, this is hard to do up here because the cord is pulling down on the vacuum. You have a filter here, a second filter here. So we have these two as our pre-filters. Here's the air inlet. Then there is a post motor filter. It's just a piece of foam. It's not sealed or anything. Right now it is. There is a seal right here. So it is sealed. That's kind of cool. I don't think that'll make much of a difference considering it's just a piece of foam, but I don't know if the bin comes off. That would be super disappointing if it, oh, drip bin release. Okay, now how do you empty the bin? I don't see a latch. So you must pull this. That's how you open it, okay. So how does this bin work though? Okay, so the dirt comes in through. Okay, so here we go. So the air enters through here, spins around, and then the dirt exhausts into the bin here. Sorry if I'm not filming that. The dirt comes in through here, spins around the outside of cyclone and then deposits the dirt into here and then the clean air goes through the screen 
through this back part into here and then up through that air channel right in there. And then through this opening here, through there, and up into the filters. A little complicated, but we figured it out. He wants this guy is four amps. So not extremely powerful, but it is a little hand back. So and honestly it doesn't weigh very much. I can see this being useful as a quick pickup back. So it does have two speeds. Hopefully the brush roll is on low speed and doesn't completely turn the power head off. It's one interesting cyclone, I will say. One interesting cyclone. So the dirt and comes into the bin through this opening right here. And enters the, it enters the cyclone from here and then exits right there. The air comes through this front part right here, through this little channel right here, through that opening, up into the filters, through the motor and out the exhaust. A little complex. Um, let's do the can you clean stairs with the test. If so, I'll have a stair cleaning video coming up. Indeed you can. Perfect. So I will be cleaning the stairs with this machine. So I can't think of much else. There is the piece of the stand. Just like that. Not sure how the stand is supposed to work, but figuring out. One must have somewhere to hook this onto. Or the power head. Yeah, there's that. I'm not sure how this stand is supposed to work, but it does somehow. So I hope you enjoyed this video of the Eureka Flash corded stick vac, and there'll be a first test video coming soon.